We've had a lot of guys who are naturally unselfish people. And in basketball, you know, with five players, um, ball has to move. You know, the we always say the ball moves faster than the defense. And so you can have the best defense on earth playing against you, the greatest athletes on earth, but the ball's still going to move faster. And if you can get all five guys in concert sharing the ball um, and, and practicing the right fundamentals and doing the right things on the court, you know, you got a chance to uh, to be successful and um, so it translates directly to winning because basketball is a, a game that that is on with five people on the floor all the time i think real strength lies in uh, knowing what you don't know in empowering others um, being secure in your own skin um, and you know, being able to lead by sometimes um, letting others lead and then kind of steering the ship. And that's that's how I try to coach. Um, I take a lot of advice from our players, from our management and ownership, um, try to make it as much of a, uh, a group effort as possible. And I think that um, sometimes is looked at as um, soft you know sometimes people will look at those qualities and think oh that's not a leader um when in actuality the, the, uh, the strongest leaders in, in my mind are, are people who understand that dynamic and empower others and and, uh, and take advice the vast majority of successful people uh, are ones who collaborate and take responsibility and care for others and in whatever realm of life you're talking about um, if you do those things you become a better husband father son uh, friend um, employee boss coach teacher um, because people are going to enjoy working with you and being around you and and that's ultimately the best uh, springboard for a really healthy and productive and fun life.